beer fests. Those amazing little excursions that bring together my fave things in life. Brews, buds, and good times. I've been fortunate enough to visit numerous beer fests around the world, so I know a good one when I see it. I'm here at Warner's at the Bay, where an amazing lineup of breweries is set to come together to create a spectacle that is unlike any other. One that could arguably be labelled as Sunday, 19th November, Warners at the Bay once again plays host to its well-regarded beer fest. It's in its 11th year and it's bringing some fresh twists that I for one am really excited for. And here's why you should be too. If you've ever been to a beer fest then you know the drill. You buy your ticket, you get your tokens and get to work on sampling some top brews. Only problem with that is, tokens suck. You never have enough, and by the time you buy more, you spend more than you ever wanted to. Well at Warner's, they're doing things a little different. They want you to try every brew that you want to. So with your ticket, you get to try all drinks from every supplier. And while we're talking suppliers, this year Warner's Fest brings together not only the best and brightest homegrown talent, but also fantastic international breweries like New Belgium, Boone and Roddenbach. All for the amazing price $60. That's the same price as last year. So unless you're the type of person who puts two and two together and gets five, you should know that Warner's Festival 2017 is a deal too hard to refuse. With the addition of bringing in ciders and wines, this truly is a festival that you and all your friends and family can attend together.